Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. A very warm welcome to, to the presentation. We are Pinnacle BIM Technology Gyambeha, uh, based out in, in Munich. Our headquarters are in, in India. What we do, we are a BIM service uh, provider. That means we are helping the industry to execute BIM projects in case uh, they, need, they need assistance. We are exhibiting in Hall 3.2 on booth A3.024. Please visit us. So what our vision is, what we are trying to do, we are bringing the certainty and efficiency using the BIM technology in the projects. And our mission is to optimize resources, cost, and quality through the innovative use of BIM technology throughout the project cycle. These are some of the advantages that we, that we offer. So we have been existing for quite a long time. We have 30 plus years of experience. All we have done so far is BIM. So that makes us very confident about executing the BIM projects. We know what challenges the industry faces and we know how to overcome, how to overcome all of them. We have done more than 5,000, uh, worked with them for more than 5,000 plus satisfied clients, more than 10,000 plus projects across 42 countries using ISO certified work processes. Uh, we are quite versatile. That means that we work on all the disciplines, be it architecture, structure, concrete, uh, MEP, fire protection. So anything where BIM is involved, we can, we can figure that out. We are quite a huge team. We are 3,400 people uh, across India, US, UK, Europe, and Middle East. We are very competitive. That means we have different business models for different type of customers. So let's say for Tegia planners, we have different uh, workflows. For Tegia contractors, we have different. For architecture, we have different business models. And we have extensive library of 3D families. We make sure that there are always clarifications when we are working on the project. We are always clear with the technical standards. We make sure that there is no rework. We make sure that the work always goes on and never stops. We make sure that we are optimizing the cost. We are not wasting money. We are not wasting the material. By adding value engineering, that's one of the biggest important factor in all the projects. We work on innovation, so we, we are a big fan of automation. Uh, we, we have built a, a great R&D team that works on creating plugin tools that can be integrated with BIM softwares. We have recently released a, a series of packages consisting plugin tools for, for mechanical, for architecture, and some for common uh, that are used for clash coordination. And we are selling those as our products now. We are quite committed to the excellence because we have 30 plus years of long lasting uh, and time tested process. And we are very transparent with our customers. This is our growth. So you can see we have massively growing over the last few years. And you can see the distribution between our teams. Uh, we have more of mechanical engineers, and then we have architects, civil engineers, electrical engineers, and then people from different uh, departments. But they are big enough to execute all the large-scale projects. This is our work experience. We have worked in more than 42 countries. So we have adopted the codes and standards that every region uses in the project. And we have more of our projects coming in from North America, Europe, Middle East, and Asia Pacific. These are the solutions that we provide. So as you can see, uh, from the very beginning uh, of the project cycle, that is the bidding stage, uh, and to the end stage, which is operations, where we work on the as-built, uh, we cover up everything. So we have pre-bid estimation service that helps the contractors to participate in the tenders. We help with marketing presentations for general contractors. 
We work on 4D and 5D simulations. We do have a team that is involved in planning, so we do the planning as well using multiple uh, software. It could be uh, MEP design calculations uh, for HVAC, energy optimization, for structure, architecture. And then once we are done with the planning, we move to the pre-construction stage where we work on BIM activities. We create the 3D model using the planning. We do the clash coordination across the services. We do constructability review and make sure that whatever is modeled is feasible to construct on the site. We add value engineering. We extract bill of materials out of the 3D model. We generate 3D and 3D and 2D shop drawings that can uh, help the people on the construction site. And we also do digital prefabrication for a lot of our plumbing and piping projects. We move to the construction stage where we uh, work on BIM to field integration uh, that help us for the, for the facility management. We put, we put details in the form of parameters in every equipment that is modeled in 3D on the 3D model. And we, we also use uh, those as a, uh, as a facility management processes. We move to the production and cost control. So we make sure that uh, we are making uh, and utilizing the money in, in the right amount of equipment that we buy on the construction site. We move to the operation stage where we work on as-built updates. We work on facility management and digital twin. And as I mentioned, automation, uh, we, we have the developers that are making the tools that can um, make the processes very short and less time consuming using the programming languages such as Dynamo, API. These are our production centers based in India. So our, our teams are based in India. And then we have all our uh, sales offices across the world. So you can see we are we exist in, in different parts of the world. We have, we have our office in Munich here. So these are some of the infrastructure projects that we have recently executed. This one is uh, Saudi Riyadh KSP. Uh, that is a metro station uh, project. And we were responsible for the bridge modeling. We were responsible for tunnel modeling, including architecture and landscape modeling. So we were responsible uh, for modeling, coordination, and shop drawings. This is another uh, bridge project, which is called Halim uh, Segnim Road PJT, uh, which was a cable stayed bridge. And we were responsible for full concrete 3D model, rebar modeling, frame modeling, and 2D drawings. These are some other uh, projects across Europe um, and Middle East. So we have been part of uh, Koran rail track in Austria, where we did the 3D model and we extracted the quality quantity takeoffs. We were also involved in Dubai Metro. So we worked on creating the 3D model and 4D walkthroughs for the whole project. We have been part of London Overground Barking Extension based in UK and we were responsible for 3D model and 2D shop drawings. And we were, we were also involved in Riyadh Metro Station based in Saudi Arabia, where we were responsible for 3D model, quantity takeoffs, 2D and 3D shop drawings, as-built model, and BIM standardization. These are some more tunnel and cross-town uh, metro station projects. We are also involved in scan to BIM services. That means we are converting the point clouds into 3D model using uh, Autodesk and Bentley products. So we are making the cost effective uh, and quality output using the softwares. We are saving your time uh, to travel. Uh, we have the scanning partners across Europe that can help you sc um, scan scan the project, and then we can change it into a 3D model. We have, uh, we can do the scanning for every, uh, every phase of the construction project. This is what we do. We work on SBUILT 3D models and data-rich 3D models using the COBE method. 
that is used for a lot of large scale projects such as stadiums, hospitals, and many more. These are some of the samples. So we get the input point cloud. We create the architecture and structure, and even the MEP elements that are quite complex to, to build in 3D. These are some more. This is our work process, so how we are uh, fitting into our customer's process. We get the inquiries in the form of CAD drawings, in the form of planning documents, in the form of tender documents. And we calculate the approximate number of hours that we need to do the job. Once we have the estimation and approval from the client, we move to the team introduction we introduce full-time relationship manager or a BIM coordinator uh, based, in, based in Germany, and then also a project manager based in India. We start with a kickoff meeting where we finalize codes and standards, file sharing platforms, how to proceed, and number of coordination meetings that we need to have in the week. And also we create the BIM execution plan for a lot of our projects. We move to the we move to the BIM part where we create the 3D model. Uh, we share RFIs with our customers, providing the engineering solutions. And we make sure that uh, they, are, they are implemented in the model. And we also do the assumption log while reviewing the planning because there are always inconsistencies in the design. So we review the design and we inform our customers that this is what needs to be changed. We provide the solution or we get the alternative solution from our customers. We make changes in the model and then we proceed. We do the coordination across the disciplines for MEP, architecture, structure, and we then go through the quality check process where we check the model using the automation tools. We also check the shop drawing using the automation tools and manually. We have our own department for auditing that makes sure that the project is the project team is following the internal workflow. It's called Center of Excellence. And also we have the training departments that are, that are just making sure that all the engineers are trained on the multiple softwares. And we have R&D department that is working on automation. And as a deliverable, we provide coordinated models, shop drawings, and facility management. So that's our work process. These are our software collaboration platforms. We are one of the biggest partner of Autodesk. So we use all the Autodesk products and Bentley's products as well, and then all uh, other useful softwares. We are quite open to the softwares, so we can also implement new softwares if our customer wants us to. We can buy the licenses, train our resources, and assist our customers to execute the project. These are some of the more. Have more. So that was it. If anyone has any questions, I would love to answer them.